Can you identify this book? This is Dragon Ball Volume 7. Nice. In today's video, I'll show you how to set up Meta AI outside of US. As you might already know, Meta announced that they will be releasing Meta AI Assistant to the Quest devices in United States and Canada. Sitting here at Dinesh Studio, as you can see, I could not wait for its release in the other parts of the world. So I tried the most obvious hack using VPN. I used NordVPN. I'm not really sure about others, but after setting the region to US and restarting my headset, I received a software update. For reference, this is the version I'm currently on. After updating my headset, I went to the experimental settings and I saw that the Meta AI option was there, but I was not able to turn it on. Right when I was about to give up, I wanted to try one last thing. Not sure if it really helped, but I changed the time zone to New York. That's the same region that my VPN was currently on. And this time, when I restarted my headset, I was finally able to enable it and test it. When you launch the AI Assistant for the first time, it tells you what you can do and what's not possible. Once you're done with the tutorials, you can try out its capabilities by yourself. You can use it for system interactions, for example, launching an application or taking a picture. You can use it to have a conversation and get real-time information like when does Meta plan on giving developers the access to camera feed or when do they plan on releasing this feature to the other parts of the world? Jokes apart, you get the point. But the coolest feature of all is AI vision. It can answer your questions just by looking at your camera feed. Obviously, it has its limitation, but it does really well otherwise. Now, if you want to configure the AI settings like changing its voice, you can do so by navigating inside settings, systems, meta AI. On this page, you can also have a look at your activity and delete them. And that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one.